What's going on? Not much. You got kids? Of course. How many you got? Why you huffing and puffing? Because I got six. Damn. Nigga, your health at critical hit. You one shot away, literally. God damn to the left. Why? I mean, I ain't trying to deal with that. Nigga, you ain't got to deal with that shit. I take care of mine, nigga. You got six kids. Yes, and I take care of mine. You ain't got to take care of mine. Yeah, okay, right. Yeah, I'm still good. <laughs> she belongs to the streets. So to the left? Yeah. Tu estas loco. <laughs> Don't do that. That shit turn me on, though, kid. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Come on, get up right. out of here. Get up. No, Come on, to baby. To the right. To Come the on. right. It ain't to the left. To the right. To the right, nigga. Security. Yeah, get out of here. I don't heard about Hey. They ass be crazy. Nah, being damn near 30 with six kids on a YouTube channel trying to date a rapper is just diabolical. With six kids, you already got a family. Hell, you got a starting five plus somebody coming off the bench. He gonna be buying $100 worth of Happy Meals. These 20 women versus one men videos are getting crazy. I'm good. How you doing? Why are you standing like that? <laughs> Stand up, shit. You gotta be louder. Like I'm high as I do more drugs than me you too. ever imagined. That's not, okay. I know. You just rap and do drugs? I make money. That's it? Oh, okay. What's your name again? Jayla. Jayla? Yeah. You ratchet? Do I look ratchet? You act ratchet, like, like your attitude. You the one that's over here like this. But you the crazy one. I do drugs! But I'm ratchet. You can go. Crack is cheap. Now the black community gotta go back to shaming these drug addicts. Since when was it cool to become a crackhead? When I was growing up, that was the ultimate insult. Now these dudes wearing it like a badge of honor. Y'all smoking crack! How many hours do you work, Eric? 60 hours a week. 60 hours a week. And how many hours do you work at home? The same, more. All day, all night. Really? And then you woke up? Hung, 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 hung. And I don't think people understand how easy it is to infer that someone who's a female artist or a female in our industry is somehow doing something wrong by wanting love, wanting money, wanting success. Women are not allowed to want those things the way that men are allowed to want them. You're a victim. Mm. Womp womp, you're damn near a billionaire. Stop complaining about oppression. And then she's just making stuff up to start a narrative. Nobody ever said that women in music can't have love. Stop it. Get some help. Do we need men? No. Do we need men? Um, no. No? We don't need short men. Do you need a man? No. Do you need a man? Oh, God. Do you need a man? No. Do we need men? No. Why? No. Do we need men? No. No? Do we need men? We need men to make us stupid. Do we need men? Do we need men? No. Do women need men in this world? No. Do we need men? No. Why? Because we can be strong, independent women. Do we need men? Like, not necessarily, but like, if I can look at them. Like, we need a man to look at. Do we need men? No. no. Why? Nobody needs men. Really? We do not need men. Why not? Why do we need men? We need all men. Why, why would I need men? So what, do, what, what can you get from someone else that you don't get from a man? The only thing I can get from a man that I can't get anyone else, anywhere else is dead. Okay. And I don't need dick. Do we need women? Yes. We do. Why? These women are awesome. Do we need women? Of course. Why? Because they're beautiful. Do we need women? Women make us feel compassionate and affectionate. Do we need women? Of course we do. Do we need women? Yes. Why? Because they're hot. And what else? They're hot. Do we need women? I mean, shit. Unless they're gay. Do we need women? Do we need women? Yeah. Yes, who's gonna do my dishes? And the media will still try to tell you that the red pill, Andrew Tate, right wing extremist men are the problem. The problem is feminism. I just wanna let y'all know, man. Y'all not depressed, okay? <laughs> y'all broke. <laughs> <laughs> right? You are poor. If I hire someone and they're female, I have to be careful about how I talk to them. Even As a dentist, I hire almost exclusively females, and this is not my experience. I have found that they take criticism with poise and elegance, though criticism is rarely needed or helpful. Oftentimes, when offense is taken, it is only because I do not listen and have a problem with appreciating 
what I have right in front of me. And if I just said thank you more, this wouldn't even be an issue. Is that good? Is that good? Okay. What if she lied to protect you because she loves you? I mean, that's not her choice to make, is it? No, it's not her choice, but... It, isn't that nice of her to do a convenient lie to protect me from her past? <laughs> that's awful convenient, isn't it? How yeah. nice of her to lie about her past to protect me. <laughs> That doesn't sound a little absurd to you? So you prefer your woman to never have like a sexual No, 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 past? answer my question before you ask another one. Uh -huh. Doesn't it sound a little bit convenient to say uh -huh. that she's hiding her past to protect me from it? Maybe because she loves you? She wanted to also like appease him maybe and she was like, I'm gonna lie about this situation. Well, that would be her you protecting wouldn't... herself, not Okay, you. maybe. Yes, how would it right. be protecting you? Okay. I get that. How, like she's how? How would herself. it be protecting the Not the, protecting the man you. Maybe would... she's protecting herself because you're a great guy yeah. and she wanted to be with you. I, yeah. Okay, maybe I understand that. Yes. Gotcha, bitch. The guy in that video is named Andrew Wilson from The Crucible. I'll leave a link to his channel in the pinned comments down below. He's religious, he's married, and he's a good debater. He debates people like Destiny and Vosh, and I mean, he wipes the floor with them. His arguments are sealed. He tends to go at things from a traditional religious lens, but even if you aren't religious, you should check him out. Can men get pregnant? Oh, I am. You're pregnant? Mm -hmm. You are? Yeah. How about oh, a yeah. congratulations? Instead of laughing at me, you could say like congrats or something. Congratulations, I'm sorry. Thank you, I appreciate So how it. far along are you? Two weeks. If I'm in a fire, right? And the first person that comes is a female, I'm going to assume the reason why she's there is because she's capable of getting me out of that situation more than whatever man they have on duty that day. They have ranks and they have things, jobs that they have to do, specifically when it comes but to a fire. the fact is she's not Listen, more capable than getting you out of the fire. Says who? If they says her up there, that means that she's more capable of getting no, no, me out than any capable, man. Is. Not it's, more, that just means that she could be could be capable that means we're speaking about what is best this is a this is a reason why this is a reason why single moms leads to degenerate uh do that degeneracy i'll tell you why Single, this is the reason why single moms leads to degeneracy. It breeds degeneracy into kids and to society. The reason why is because you only thinking about the emotional side of what's good. Men tend to think about what's best. What's best is that when it comes to certain things, think about nurturing. Okay, would I want to send my uh, send my kid to an all man's daycare or to an all woman's daycare? All woman. I'm not thinking in my dumb emotional mind. I'm thinking logically. All woman's daycare. Mm -hmm. Now y'all would now when we speaking about firefighters because that's the topic, right? If a building is burning down, who would you want to come save me? A man or a woman? A, a man. man. Like, that's just the facts of it. The average size for a woman in America is 5'5", five, five, 175 pounds, and it ain't muscle. So if she think that a woman's going to be able to pull her out of that building, that's going to be one big-ass barbecue. Anytime a woman gets that type of job, every time is going to be based on discrimination because there's 10 out of 10 times that there's a man that's better suited for that job that didn't get it because they had to meet a quota. And that don't sound like equality to me. Let me know in the comments below if this video was a WRL and give me the HBO special. That's a help brother out special. Hit the like and the subscribe button for more content. Till next time.